you have trouble keeping grass in your pastures? Have you tried reseeding with no improvement? Poor soil health may be the problem. Soil is the medium in which your grass grows, and it contains the nutrients that grass needs. Healthy, fertile soil is the basis for successful pasture growth. Annual or biannual soil sampling is the easiest way to monitor soil nutrient levels. It's easy to do and inexpensive, and the results will serve as a guide for how to improve your soil. The first step is to obtain a sample of your soil. Start by choosing an area to sample, such as one field or one pasture. If you have multiple fields or pastures, you'll need to obtain separate samples for each one. This farm is divided into six different fields and one sacrifice lot. The sacrifice lot does not need to be sampled, but each of the other fields should be sampled and each one should be sampled separately. Next, gather supplies. You'll need a soil sampling probe and a bucket. If you don't have a soil probe, you may be able to borrow one from your county extension office. Timing of soil sampling is also important. If the ground is too dry, you won't be able to push the probe into the ground. If it's too wet, it will be difficult to get the sample out of the probe. A day or two after a rain is generally the best time to sample. Once you're ready with your probe and bucket, simply push the probe down into the soil to a depth of about 8 inches. Then empty the soil into the bucket. To obtain the sample that represents the entire field, you'll need to take several soil cores and mix them together. Take between 10 and 15 cores per field or management unit. Walk through the field in a zigzag pattern, stopping randomly to take the cores. Avoid atypical areas of the field, such as the area under a feeder. Once you've collected enough soil cores, mix them together in the bucket. Then put a subsample of the soil into a small bag. One and a half cups is usually a sufficient amount. You can put the rest back in the field. Next, you'll need to choose a laboratory to send the sample to for testing. Specific submission procedures vary from lab to lab, so check the guidelines provided by the lab that you're using. Be sure to complete the sample submission sheet to send with your sample, and then mail the submission sheet, your sample, and payment for testing to the lab. Once the lab processes your sample, you'll receive a soil test report. The report will provide information about the current status of your soil and recommendations for improving its quality. If you need assistance interpreting your report, contact an extension office. Your local agent can help you determine what steps you should take to improve your soil fertility. This video was brought to you by University of Maryland Extension, providing solutions in your community. To learn more about our programs or to locate an office in your county, visit extension.umd.edu.